Yes, yes, yes. So there are times where I accidentally say three in a row and then I'm always like, mm, say one more, just throw it on the end. You're like, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. yeah. Welcome back to another antidote of sexy, funny, raw. And I'm here with my gorgeous friend, Reagan Fox. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. <laughs> we're here to bring you some secrets. All the things that we're thinking while we're shooting a sex scene. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? You ready? <laughs> my biggest faux pas is when I'm doing photos before we even get into sex. Mm -hmm. And they're called our pretty girl photos. And they make me do this one really obnoxious pose where you have to stand like this and then turn. So my butt and my face are in the same photo, but I don't have much of a butt. So when I turn in that really awkward direction, all you get is back ass leg. <laughs> and it's none flattering for me. And um, I don't like that photo. So that's what's going on in my mind. Pre-sex is how awesome I don't look in that position. <laughs> Usually when I'm doing that position, I have to like cup my butt and <laughs> lift it up because I have a lot. And then of course, before we take it, I'm like, did you put your wide lens on? <laughs> and that one step way really back step there. Back. <laughs> really get this at a full range. Give that surprise like, oh, there. well that's actually kind of hot. Okay. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Dirty talk. For me, I am so bad with dirty talk. So I'm constantly trying to think while I'm in the middle of a scene. I'm like, okay, well, tell him he's got nice balls then. I'm like, I get so nervous. I'm like, what do I need to say next? Like, how many times have I said mommy's titties? You know, I'm like, whoa. <laughs> be creative, be creative, be creative. <laughs> I am a dirty talker because I'm I'm, I'm not loud. I'm so I just talk really low and I just yeah. Yeah, just give that eye contact and but if I if I'm winded like that <laughs> and all of a sudden I don't talk, it's because I just can't think of anything other to say than control your breathing. <laughs> don't sound like Darth Vader. <laughs> Well, then there's that yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And I always try never to say that because that comes from a different performer throughout <gasps> the years, over the years Stuff ago. Stuff you've heard other performers say. This is how I feel during an orgy. Gross. I really want to wipe off and shower now. <laughs> I've been in one orgy. She was there. Uh, <laughs> We've had this conversation so many times, I knew this was going to come up. Wasn't into it. It was very, there was nine people there. There were five women and four girls. They're just trying nice. to fill holes, you know, and we're all just <laughs> <laughs> flicking beans and licking things, you know. And it was all very dirty. There was so much exchange of fluids, and I don't know where fluids came from, they, but they were all in my mouth. And... <laughs> It's dirty. I'm not, I'm very clean. So yeah, yeah it was hard for me. <laughs> Things that are going on in my mind. Um, mine is, I have a fear of a dry vagina. I'm an aging woman. And in my aging years, uh, things have dried out from the inside. I don't know if it's the amount of marijuana that I'm smoking and it's just drying out my mouth and then everything from there down. Or, <laughs> <laughs> or if it's just age in general and I'm like the desert and just like over time it just has to dry out. It used to be a vast ocean and then now it's just desert space. Is that accurate? Well, I don't know. Why are you asking me? <laughs> Another thing I'm, I'm constantly thinking in the middle of a scene is how long have I been in this position? And it's typically when I'm in reverse cowgirl and the thought in my mind is, now help me out. We've been here for like, what, six minutes now? Cause my legs are really and burning. The, and the director says, no, it's been about 30 seconds. Yeah, I'm gonna need 12 more minutes. You're like, oh my great. Oh. <laughs> it's a workout. Mine for reverse cowgirl is, um, because I'm older and they pair me with these young, youngins. Uh, my reverse cowgirl, I'm like, so um, he's, okay, 19, 20, okay, all right, yeah, 
now. Sure, I can do that. And um, legal. He's uh, legal. Oh, he's he's smaller than me. Oh, okay. So, um, how much does he weigh? A hundred and five. So mm. I weigh <laughs> more than him. Okay, sure. Um, so what's the first position? Reverse <laughs> cowgirl. Great. Okay. <laughs> So then I'm usually on top going, I'm really sorry. Am I breaking you? Is your rib cage okay? Oh my God. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, you're so hot. Four, five, six. Ooh, your dick feels good. Seven, Control, eight, breathing. nine. Control. Okay, this is what I typically think during a blowjob, more so than sex. Um, but that is, man, I really wish this guy would have washed his balls just for me. You know, just the thought. Just in that little extra, just extra spare moment in the shower that you could have just tickled and we both would have appreciated it. Or they came over showered but then we spent five, six hours doing dialogue. Mm. Like, dude, what could you freshen just up. go freshen up? Mm -hmm. Because if you stink, I'm gonna kiss you right afterwards. <laughs> She'll bring it back to you. She <laughs> this is probably just um, more of a me thing, but mine is, please don't pull out my hair. <laughs> I wear a lot of fake hair to set, and they are just clips, so they will come out, and that is a big one for me, is anytime they go to pull one, I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> We don't want to make this that kind of movie, <laughs> you know? I've had that happen as well, where like the it tape comes is like out? half, it's like halfway pulled, so then, you know, then it hurts and stuff. But, but you've never had one come out. Oh, no, 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 never. But I, I pulled one out on a comedy stage one time, flipped my hair like that in the middle of the set, and it came out on my hand, and I was like, what? <laughs> Everyone knows I wear hair extensions. <laughs> nah. You know, like, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? You just don't. You just it. feel sexy with hair extensions. You do. There's something about hair that's just flowing and sexy. Yeah. It, and why I wear hair extensions, um, sadly, because I sweat so much, which so I was going to say. I let my hair just go like this, and I don't really care. So I'm just like, oh, yeah, let's go. But when I wear hair extensions, my hair gets, like, super sweaty. Do you know yeah. that, too? So. Oh no, I've been around you in your sweat sex scenes. Um, I worry about my stomach grumbling and ruining a scene all the time because I don't really eat a whole lot before I go to set because I like to look skinny. <laughs> and then She's when I'm best. like in the middle of a scene, I'm like, my stomach will just go. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, that's so unsexy. It's not like poop stomach rumbles. It's like, we haven't eaten and we're going to murder you. Mine usually ruins the um, sound, oh, what is that called? The um, vo voice uh, tone? Voice room, over. Room tone. Oh, yeah, room, room tone. tone. Yeah, my yeah, stomach's yeah, always yeah. like, I'm still here and you can't yeah. silence me. Rah! Last but not least, queefing. We worry about queefing. Do you queef? I have, for sure, on set. And you know what I learned to say? And um, a gay man told me this, but I've learned to say that, ooh, that's just my pussy talking to you. Yeah, right. Yeah. As that. we get a little older, it's going to keep happening. Uh, I never used to until porn. It's more recent for it, you? Yeah, but like for example, Lucas Frost, which um, and we I, can, love. I can, yeah, I can say this because he, we shoot so much together, yeah. but he, he knows how to make someone queef, at least that's what he says out in public. So when we're together... Does he just blow air into your vagina well, and then stick his penis in? His, well, the way his penis is shaped, and he'll, I guess I'm not saying anything he hasn't already said, but he knows how to pull it out just enough to get push air into it. So he says he does it on purpose. So anytime I'm with Lucas, and, and I, I, you guys, I hope they cut my face out because as soon as it starts, I'm over there going, oh my God. <laughs> I have to turn my head around like if I'm in doggy so you can't see my head because I am literally grimacing going. <laughs> Why don't they give you my that face? I, that's just squeezing them out. That's probably what you're doing. You're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it, it's actually like I wish that my, my vagina was like a death, death grip and I like could it just was like a penis. Yeah. Yeah. Good luck with that. Yeah. Kegels. Do those work? Well, no, no, you just had a story about that on Twitter, so I'm not sure. 
Have kegels work? Well, yeah, you said you, you jump roped or something. Oh, then I haven't done just... kegels. That's why <laughs> yeah. I needed to do some kegels. You needles. should let me know if that works. I did really jump rope the other day, and it was not a pleasant experience for me. I was like, I need to kegel. We need to... <laughs> we just talked about it on Twitter. <laughs> I'm so honest. <laughs> Right, and that's it for the day. Great time. Yeah, this is very funny. that was a uh, sexy, funny raw yeah. on the road uh, with Reagan Fox. You guys, if you like what you see, click subscribe. Until next time, adios.